up. Check the bag. Check the bag. Check the bag. I just, I just love it. I just, I just love her so much. I'm hype. I know this is a lot. <sighs> okay. Hey guys, what's up? It's Taylor. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be super, super special because it is a first for me. And um, yes, we'll get right into that in just a second. But if this is your first time ever watching me, hello, my name is Taylor. Welcome to the Taylor Gang. I hope that you will subscribe and definitely give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it and want to see more content like it. This video is very, very special because it's my first ever purchase from Gucci. Oh, check it out. Check the bag. Check the bag. Check the bag. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. So, uh, it's my first purchase from Gucci. So if you want to see the bag that I got from Gucci, um, stay tuned and give this video a big thumbs up. Okay. Okay. So, all right. Anyway, I fell in love with this bag the first time that I saw it. When did I see this bag? Maybe in like a Bloomingdale's that I saw this bag. I fell in love the first time I saw it and it just kept popping up and popping up and popping up. And I just kept making excuses for myself like, no, you shouldn't really buy that bag. It's really expensive. Um, you could pay for other things with it. But you know what? Sometimes you got to treat yourself. That's why we work, right? We work to treat ourselves fabulously like queens. Treat yourself, girl. And that is exactly what I did when I walked my little self into Gucci and bought the bag. Okay. So the experience. I wanted to buy the bag from the Gucci store, okay? I wanted to just walk into Gucci leisurely and then have an experience. I didn't want to just buy it online. Um, I know there are some discount retailers that you can get amazing deals on, not knocking that by any means, but I wanted the Gucci experience in New York City and I got it, okay? I got it. So, all right. I walk into Gucci and it's fantastic, right? It's three huge floors. I went to the Gucci on Fifth Avenue in New York City in Manhattan and it was lovely. Those people were so friendly. They were like, oh, hello, hello. Can I get you anything? Can I grab you some water? Can I grab you this? Can I grab you that? And I was like, oh my God, yes. And in my head, I was like, I'm about to buy this bag that I had been eyeing for about a month and a half. So um, yes, I'll take some champagne, please. So I had a glass of champagne that I was just sipping leisurely as I was strolling through. So the sales uh, attendant, Irvin, who is amazing, I have his card. He was like, hello, I'm Irvin, nice to meet you. Um, if you. If I can show you anything, are you looking for anything in particular? And I was like, you know what? Yes, I am. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I'm looking for a particular Gucci bag and he was like, oh yes, we do have that in stock, but you know, they go quickly. Um, also, rewinding a little bit, I decided to buy the bag when I, when I bought it on Thursday because Gucci increased their price the following day, so on Friday. So I felt even more pressure to need to go ahead and buy this bag before the price goes up because I feel like that makes sense, right? Get it, you know, while the price is still lower so that you don't have to pay the marked up price. I, I just went ahead and bought it. I was going to wait for my birthday, but which is in December, but I was just like, let me just get this now because the price is going to be a little bit lower and with taxes and stuff, it's going to make a difference. So I perused around Gucci and finally I came to the lovely bag that I have been eyeing for so long. I look at the bag and it's still like tugging at my heart. It's just got me. You know how you see something and you're just like, mm, I love you. I love you. It was one of those items. It was definitely calling my name. It was just like Taylor, Taylor, Taylor. Um, so I just, you know, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna get this bag, Urban. I hope that's what his name is. I really do. Without further ado, let's start the official unbagging of my first Gucci bag purchase ever. <laughs> and this is actually my first like luxury bag purchase ever. So it was just so exciting. This is like, this video is great. I don't even know how it's gonna turn out. Okay, so anyway, this is the bag that it comes in. Lovely, lovely. And it's really blown out right now, but you can just see it's just plain Gucci, very nice sleek black and white bag that it came in. Um, and yes, they tied it up. So I haven't actually opened this since I purchased it on Thursday. So we're gonna be reunited. <laughs> we're gonna be reunited. Um, so here we go. I'm gonna untie this bad boy. Lovely bow for you. Mm. They give you your receipt in this lovely little case here. Um, if you want to know how much the bag was, just let me know and I will tell you. Um, or you can just go online, you'll see. Um, but if you want to know how much it is with taxes and stuff before the price increase, I can let you know that. I did look on Gucci and the price definitely went up. It went up about $200. So 
So glad I got in quick. Okay. All right, so we're pulling it out. Uh, it comes in this lovely duster bag. Let's go ahead and open her up. <gasps> I just, I just love it. I just love it. I'm so excited. Oh my God, guys, oh, this bag is just stunning. Stunning. Oh, and there she is. There she is. Oh my God. Just love her so much. I'm hype. I know this is a lot, guys. This is my first designer bag that I've ever purchased, however. Um, so I'm going to be hype and um, I hope that you'll just share my excitement <laughs> and let, let me know how you felt when you bought your first designer bag because um, I'm certainly hype right now but she is a beaut right it's just so gorgeous it's velvet it's lush it has this really cute heart design on the back I don't know if you can see it a little bit there um, you can wear the strap one of two ways you can wear it like this um, just like um, on your elbow or you can have the longer strap option and just slay in that way. Yes. I have not carried this yet. Today might be that day though. So let's put the strap down very carefully <laughs> and open it up. To open this bag, you have to press the little button underneath, uh, which is kind of hard to do with nails, but we worked it out anyway. Yes. Um, and they packaged it pretty nice. So I'm going to pull out the pack. This is like an official unbagging. I have not touched this bag since I bought it. Um, and inside is pink. Oh my God. How adorable is that? Oh, I just love that. I just, I just love that it's pink in there. It just, this bag is giving me so much life right now. Y'all do not even know. I'm going to pull this out. A little swatch of velvet. Does anyone know why they give you this? Um, bag buyers could you enlighten me um so i'm pulling out just whatever was in this little pocket here it says gucci responsibly <laughs> i did hear that since it's velvet it picks up lint so i might need to grab like a lint roller <laughs> I, I mean i've been needing one of those since forever anyway i'm just a linty individual but anyway um i love the bag i think it looks so cute you're gonna see it on my instagram if you're not following my instagram you should if you want to see more of this beauty um but i absolutely love it the velvet feels so lush and fantastic the quality like this bag is gonna last years and years it's gonna be a great investment as um gone up in value because the price went up so literally the day after i bought it this bag went up in in value which is pretty amazing if i ever wanted to sell it i don't ever think that i would because it's my first gucci bag my first luxury designer bag purchase and i am totally smitten over it if i did ever want to resell resell it it would do very very well because it's timeless it's i'm gonna wear this bag um all the time the the one of the attendants was like yeah this is a great bag for winter and i was like yeah for winter <laughs> this bag is i'm gonna carry this thing like religiously on the weekends of it i think that it was money well spent and it is a splurge item for sure i i don't make big purchases like this all the time. If you check out my other video, you know that I have a pair of Manolos that I absolutely adore. So I cannot wait to just wear those Manolos and carry this Gucci bag and just be slaying, okay? Slaying the city. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so this is my babe and I absolutely love it. It just, you know, it just looks so good. <laughs> um, okay guys, so that just about wraps up my Gucci unbagging I just keep looking at it so that pretty much wraps up my sorry the lighting is weird I'm gonna get closer the light is on my face but I hope you enjoyed my very first Gucci bag luxury review well not a, not a review unbagging um I just it has my heart so if you guys like this video definitely give it a thumbs up um i would love to buy designer bags every week but <laughs> the way my life is set up i can't really do that just yet but maybe eventually you never know you never know um so anyway i hope you guys really love this video don't forget to like comment subscribe follow me on instagram if you are not already i'm on instagram stories like all the time um, so yeah, let's be friends. Okay. Anyway, uh, I'm going to wrap this video up because I'm really excited as you can tell, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.